Hi, this is Todd with Not 10 Yacht Sales. Today we're going to take a look at a 1984 Post 43 Sport Fisherman. Let's go take a look. So it's a beautiful December day here on the Chesapeake, um, about a week before Christmas. So this boat uh, is currently on land. Again, it's a 84 Post 43 convertible, or sport fish rather. Um, walking down the port side. All your gel coats in nice condition, bottoms in good condition. All your running gear. This boat's been used as a cruising boat, so it's got the swim platform, the teak swim platform, which is good, no impact or issue there. Scanning around the starboard side. A little tough because you got the sailboat on the jack stands butted up right next to it, but you can see the hull still has some nice shine to it. And we'll go inside the cockpit. On the swim platform on the Post 43, again, teak swim platform goes full beam, nice transom door. Allows you to easily step into this huge cockpit. Um, all teak washboards around the cockpit. Storage underneath the decking. You won't see any crazing or any spider web cracks on the boat. You have a wet bar, little tackle station. This boat's been cruised, so it's not been fished. Nice storage on the that wet bar. We'll go into the salon a little bit. Easy to get up to the bow. Notice there are no um, outriggers. So nice wide gunnels on both port and starboard. Pop up to the bridge is pretty simple. And I'm doing this one-handed while I'm holding the camera. Full electronics, there's a Raymarine radar, which is on a gimbal bracket, which is removed for the winter. Robertson autopilot, Garmin GPS chart plotter, um, Raymarine digital depth gauge. Of course, all your controls. But it also has an engine sink, fuel crossovers, um, nicely set up. Canvas is just a couple years old. You'll notice the eyes and glass is very, very clear. All your zippers are in good shape. There are um, full canvas panels that go across the back when the boat's in storage. Awesome visibility, super easy boat to maneuver and dock. You can literally see every corner on the boat. Seating along this port side, seating in front of the helm. Again, you can look at that clear eyes and glass, huge bow. Walking into the salon of the Post 43. Awesome layout. On your port side, you have this L-shaped couch, which is a recent upgrade. Little bar space here. Let's put a little club chair on the starboard side. I opened up the blinds on these windows because I wanted to highlight them. The, all this glass, all the frames have all been redone. So you don't have those water leak issues that you'll see in boats of this era. So both your salon windows are have professionally been redone, so you don't have any of those challenges. Nice surround sound system. We got a Sony LCD screen, storage all across this back bar. This has got a galley down. We'll step in there in a second. Just kind of scanning around. We're gonna step down to the galley. Four quick steps down. This, of course, is on your port side. 
Again, still walking down. Here's your sink. Nice oven. Triple burner stove. Large refrigerator freezer. Plenty of galley storage. Of course, microwave. Beautiful parquet wood floors. We'll look at the staterooms. Lighting's going to be a little bit of a challenge. But the, on the starboard side, this is that uh, second stateroom, which is, of course, got on, uh, over under bunks, storage underneath the lower bunk, hanging locker, and uh, of course, two drawers. And its own privacy door. Just forward to that on that same starboard side is your uh, head. This is a single head boat, vacuum flush toilet, separate shower stall, nice vanity. We'll go take a look at the forward stateroom. Here we are looking at the forward stateroom. Uh, your uh, forward berth, large, with storage underneath. Those drawers pull out. On port and starboard, you have two large hanging lockers on this port side, as well as on that starboard side. And then you have access to the single head that's midship. Kind of scanning around. No leaks, no smells. Boat is very, very nice inside and out. Through the magic of editing, we're gonna be looking at the engine space. Got the engine hatch open. Looking forward, there's your Westerby diesel generator with 2,500 hours. Scanning around, there's your port motor. These are Detroit 671 TIs that are 450 horsepower a piece. There's roughly 900 hours since major overhauls with documentation. Boats had a rock solid maintenance history. Scanning around looking at the uh, starboard motor. Sorry if it's a little shaky. It's kind of scanning around for you guys. Nice, well-kept engine space. Very mindful owner. Hi, this is Todd with Not 10 Yacht Sales. I want to thank you very much for watching this YouTube video on the 1984 Post 43 Sportfish that I have listed here for sale. I have the current offered price I have in the description of this YouTube video, as well as my contact con uh, information. So feel free to give me a call if you have any questions about this boat or any of the boats that I have listed for sale. Again, thanks for watching and safe boating.